YouTube. I apologize again. I've been on the road. I'm still on the road. I've been on the road for a year, nine months already. People get with it, uh, get with the program. Um, I'm traveling, going all over the place, uh, doing a couple of different things. And uh, recently I just uh, left, uh, was staying with a uh, friend of mine from YouTube, YouTube card trader, card collector. I told him I was be, I'm going to be leaving Thursday and uh, to my next destination, and he says, "Oh, you can't stay until the weekend." He wanted to know, you know, if I could stay a few more days, because there was a card show on the weekend. I told him I'm not into card shows anymore because they're, well, frankly, they suck. Uh, fake cards, counterfeit cards, uh, altered patches galore. Uh, fake autographs on uh, pictures on cards, uh, all you know, nonstop nonsense. And, uh, you know, I told him, I said, you know, it's not worth, you know, my time. And, he, you know, he said, he begged me to stay a few more days. He wanted me to go to the show. So I went with him and we went to the show. We looked around and, uh, I basically, I just walked up, you know, maybe one aisle and I showed him one fake after another, after another altered cards fake patches and then one guy had a table full of fake autographs on you know eight by ten pictures and you know and he actually had one of those you know babe ruth uh, autographed pictures that was printed on computer paper and uh, mickey mantle pictures autographed on uh, computer paper um which didn't exist at the time uh, they were signing uh so you know i told him i said you know i mean how much how much more garbage do you want me to show you you know, so I left, and I, you know, we after we got back to his place, I showed him. I went on to eBay, and I just showed him. I just do uh, showing you right now. You just enter right here. Mantle reprint. That's all you put in there. If you put mantle reprint, you get nine hundred and twenty-nine. Because Mickey Mantle and Babe Ruth and all the other top players, they're the most commonly counterfeited cards. Now all the all of these 900 reprints aren't counterfeit, but majority of them are. And let me show you how I know. Well, I'll just take a look at the very first one. He actually has uh, five of them. Or excuse me, yes, yeah, a lot of five. The very next one is uh, in one. Of, it's graded in um, one of these BCG holders. And here's another lot of five, which is from the same seller. And then if you notice anything about these, these haven't been uh, cut down, actually. They still have a very big white border from, you know, from the printer where they got them from. And, you know, it just goes on and on. I'm, you know, you could take a look at all these yourself. These are just for the first page, but just let me show you. The, let's go back to the first one really quick. First one, just a lot of five. You could go look at the seller and the item number there if you're interested. The very next one was one of these BCGs. You could go look at the item number. There it is. Seller. And I forgot to point out. He has 10 of them available. Go take a look at his other stuff if you're so inclined. Here's another one. The seller, carbs. Here's the item number if you're interested. Now let's go take a look at carbs. He has uh, 92 stuff available for sale at this time. He has a 1914 Cracker Jack panel, Type Cobb Warner reprints. 
Here's a magazine. Here's a Babe Ruth uh, reprint. Here's a Mickey Mantle reprint. He has a Babe Ruth reprint. He has a Mickey Mantle reprint. He has a Babe Ruth reprint. He has a Babe Ruth reprint. Sandy Koufax rookie reprint. Babe Ruth uh, candy uh, Babe Ruth reprint. He's Sam Usual reprint. Honus Wagner we, uh, the Polar Bear reprint. Uh, Mickey Mantle. One of the top style cards from 1951. Now here's a lot of 10 tobacco cards of Johnny Evers. A lot of 10 Joe Tinkers. And then here's a lot of 3 of all the one of each. And then you have 10 Jack Sesbros. Here's another Mickey Mantle reprint. And if you notice this one's a little bit aged. Here's a Mordecai Brown a lot of 10. Here's a Ty Cobb a mini lot of 10. Here's the Mickey Mantle that I just showed you. Here's a, another Ty Cobb a lot of 10. Here's another Mickey Mantle reprint. Don't forget these are all reprints people. Here's a lot of 10. Christy Mathewson. Uh, here's a Mickey Mantle. A pre-rookie card. Honus Wagner. Lot of 10. Here's a Cy Young Lot of 10. Now don't forget, these are all reprints. You can go look at them yourself, people. 1958 Tops of Mickey Mantle, uh, Ty Cobb Lot of 10. Here's a uh, another Mickey Mantle, another Babe Ruth. Here's a 1950 style pin of Mickey Mantle. Here's a Ty Cobb a reprint magazine. Here's a Bob Feller reprint. Right there, people. Magazine. Here's five Shoeless Joe Jackson from the Sporting News reprints. Don't forget, these are all counterfeits. 1956 Mickey Mantle reprint. Roy Campanella reprint. Stan Musial reprint. Yogi Berra, a lot of five reprint. Mickey Mantle. These are all from the same seller, people. Here's a lot of five Monty Irvings. Another Mickey Mantle. Here's five Willie Mays uh, rookie reprints. Here's a lot of five... Nelly Fox reprints. Here's a lot of five Pee Wee Reese reprints. Mickey Mantle. Here's a lot of five Stacy Stengels. And that's only on the first page. From one seller. Carbs. Very simple. I'll just show you the first one here. The Cracker Jacks. Because, you know, they printed a lot of these reprints. There's a seller, and there's an item number if you're interested. But like I said, I showed you, that's all he has is all reprint, basic majority, all reprints. Here's another interesting lot. It's a lot of 10 from this guy here. There's the item number, seller name. It's a new seller. Now what do you notice about these cards here? These have added onto them a counterfeit autograph, and you could buy 10 of them for one very low price. Fantastic looking reprint with reprint autograph, authentic size, same feel, same color, or and feel. Counterfeit cards, people, and these are, you know, slightly aged. Let's go take a look at what else the seller has available. Right there. He's a lot of 10 mantles reprints. Another lot of 10 mantle reprints and another lot of 10. Now these have the fake autograph on them. Now these are autograph cards, but if you notice, this lot of 10 has also the counterfeit autograph on the side here added. And don't forget, the, the sellers buy these, uh, you know, the scammers buy these. They try to get them graded and try to get them authenticated. Uh, GAI is practically authenticates everything. And, uh, you know, for a very low price, you can get these. A lot of 10 of them. 
this is on eBay, people, but they are reprints, so, you know. Here's another seller. I mean, I could go on all day long, people. Another seller. He has 43 items available. Look at this. Owen Bush Cracker Jack, an older reprint. This is nicely aged card for you. It's nicely aged. There's no bids and a couple, only two days left. Let's look what else he has. Oh, Mickey Mantle, look at that. An older reprint. This is nice and aged. It has rough corners and rough edges, everything. Here's another Mickey Mantle reprint. Oops, let's not look at the big picture. Okay, let's, why not? Let's, let's look at it, see if the connection's working today. See, nice and rough edges, it's aged nicely. Rare Rookie 61, there's the item number if you're interested, but like I said, go look at his other stuff, he has plenty. Look at this, Mickey Mantle, nice rough edges. There's another Mickey Mantle, older reprint with nice rough edges, nice used uh, look to it. Another Mickey Mantle, and the rough edges, everything, aged, some of them have little dirt on there and everything. Another Mickey Mantle, older, look at this, another Mickey Mantle, another Mickey Mantle, Babe Ruth, Babe Ruth, Babe Ruth, Babe Ruth, damn usual, nice rough edges, looks like it's been used, and uh, oh, it looks like it's really old, and it's been around the block a few times, uh, from somebody's private collection, that's the way these sellers sell them. I mean, do you want me to go on? I mean, it could go on all day, people, Duke Snyder, these are all from the same seller. Nice Yogi Berra here, older reprint. Willie Mays, come on, look at this, people. Reprints, super rare, older reprint. Ted Williams with the nice rounded edges, the older looking age. Ted Williams, let's go. Ty Cobb, well, how many more do you want to see? Ty Cobb, Ty Cobb, look at this, really rough edges. Another Ty Cobb with really rough edges. Jackie Robinson reprints, look at this, people. Satchel Page, Steve Carlton, rookie reprint, older aged. Look at that, and all these sell, these are, not, what, all the shows, other people sell them as authentic, they sell them at auctions as authentic, Gil Hodges, reprint, there you go, come on, Willie Mays, Joe DiMaggio, I haven't seen him yet, older reprint, look at this nice age card, Gehring, there you go, Shoeless Joe, Shoe, Joe Jackson again, Sykes Cobb. Bronco Nagurski, even. Let's not leave some football out. Will Chamberlain reprint. Come on, shout out basketball. There you go. No, back to Mickey Mantle. Look at this nice Honus Wagner. I could go all day, people. Look at that. That is a reprint. You get it for 99 cents. So let a show make a lot of money. That's what everybody else is doing. Why not? Come on, join the party. Join all the other freaking scammers at those local shows near you. Walter Johnson, Roger Hornsby. Walter Johnson, Elroy Hirsch, back to football. Come on, Otto Graham, rookie reprints. Look how long I've been talking, people. I can show you for hours. And this is what you see at the show. Trying to sell these for lots of money. Get them on eBay for 99 cents. I just showed you how. That's why I don't like going to shows, people. Dream big. Sometimes small dreams ain't worth having. Heaven, if you 